around not completing action items. That's exactly what we're talking about over here. Use this as a learning opportunity. So say, you know, as Luke gets to number 32 and he has to kind of confess and say he didn't get a chance to get to that, you want to piggyback on that. You don't want to waste that opportunity. You want to say, well, Luke, I think this is a wonderful time for us to kind of revisit our, our, our ground rules because I know Luke's not the only one who has a crisis pump, uh, pop up every now and then. How do we want to deal with that? If you accept a task or an action item, but then something comes up that's going to prevent you from completing that, What's our agreement going to be around that? And then you just let the team talk about it, see what they want to come up with. But either way, whatever they come up with is going to be so much easier for you to later enforce. That's the key. You want them to come up with that ground rule.